Hello everyone, welcome to another Vlog 5 video. Today, I'm gonna be doing science tricks. Now, I actually got this idea from uh, an old channel I used to watch like nine years ago called Quirkology. He used to do these like really cool science tricks and uh, I saw one of his videos pop up on my feed the other day. You know, it just brought back so much nostalgia, I started watching his videos again. So I thought it'd be a good idea to, you know, try some of the science tricks he has on his channel. And I picked a few of them. I picked about uh, six or seven maybe? Yeah, I have six right here. I might not try all of them. It just depends. And some of them have very high risk because there's one where uh, if I mess it up, I'll get water all over myself. So uh, stay tuned for that. Hopefully it doesn't happen. But I mean, if it does, I guess it'll be funny. It'll be annoying for me. But some of these also are very well known. Like the first one I'm going to do is pretty well known. It has, you know, something to do with static electricity. By the way, if you don't know like what these science tricks are, it's like really cool things. Kind of like party tricks in a way, but like they're more sciencey. I don't know, like you'll you'll see. Just stay tuned and you'll see them all. But before we start, I'm on the road to 100 subs, so please consider subscribing if you guys like sniping videos, cut comms, skits, challenges, and GFL videos. And without further ado, let's get to the first science trick. This one's pretty. All right, guys, this one's pretty well known. Um, I'm gonna do this one first because. I don't want this sitting here. This is pepper and milk. You guys might have seen this trick before in like uh, school, but you get dish soap and the pepper will move away if you put your finger in it, so. Very weird. You cannot run from me. All the freaking things on, but yeah, see how it all went to the edge? That's the trick. I think you know why I did this first, but it's still pretty cool. Uh, but for this next one, I have to rub this straw because I'll be back after my air turns off. All right, now let's continue with the video. So basically I have to rub this and have it get static electricidized and then I can kind of control it with my fingers. So that's what we're gonna do. I think this blanket right here will work. Hopefully it will. All right, let's see. It kind of worked, a little bit. It's like very, very minimal though. Whoa, it's working. It's not focusing though. All right, this kind of works. Um, everyone's done this, it's just static electricity. So, I mean, this wasn't a really big one. It kind of worked, but the other ones I'm gonna do are way more interesting and uh, let's get right into them. Because the first two were, you know, just ones that everyone should know. But if you don't, like, I guess I showed them to you. But this next trick is pretty cool. Uh, it's another one that, you know, you guys might know. But it's where you kind of lean against the door. And then you step away and your arm will just, like, magically raise, apparently. Uh, I don't know if I've ever done this. I've seen people do it before. But I don't think I've ever tried it for myself. So, uh, let's go try it. I forgot how long I have to do it. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna lean against the door for a minute. And that should be enough, so... Let's see what happens. All right, let's see. Kind of, it just feels funny. This one doesn't really work. My arm's not raising up. Maybe I did it wrong. I'll look into it and if I did it wrong, I'll do it again. But uh, this one didn't actually work. So it's kind of weird. I did it wrong. I did it wrong. But here's me doing it right. What is that? Why is my arm raising? Why? This is a really cool one. Um, I've always wanted to try this, but I never did. But I'm gonna take this tea bag, empty it, and then make it into a rocket. But first, let me dump this out and I'll be back. All right guys, this one's a little dangerous, but basically I have to light this right here and then it's gonna fly up to the roof. Probably gonna record from a distance so we can actually see the uh, effect Got a letter right here, and uh, I'm gonna be lighting this paper right here and seeing it fly. So here we go. I really hope it doesn't burn the house down. Here we go. I don't like this. 
Ooh, I do not like that. It wasn't doing it. It wasn't flying. That's... Okay. Yeah, I don't know if it would have worked if I kept it, but... That was... <laughs> that was a big flame. Um... Okay. That was bad. That I My heart dropped. Literally. Holy crap. That was a freaking fail. That was so my. That scared the crap out of me, dude. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. The guy that... He he had a smaller one. I'm going I'm to stay in here for a little bit and watch to see if any of these do anything. I'm pretty sure I'm good, but... Okay, so how it's supposed to work is it burns, and as it goes to the bottom, it floats up. But it wasn't floating up. It just wasn't. I don't know if I should have waited a little bit longer, but that flame was big. Okay, um, next trick. It's kind of the opposite of what we just did, because this one has to do with water. So, I have a balloon right here, right? Now, if I put this lighter under it, it should burst. But, watch this. Yeah, it did it. Was that cool? I don't know, but there's water in this. And it didn't burst, but I think it would have burst if I didn't have water in it. It's pretty weird. It just has a black mark on it. Anyway, last trick. So this trick is actually pretty scary, and I'm probably going to change my clothes just in case this goes wrong, but what I'm going to be doing is getting this cup of water, putting paper over it, Flipping it over, and you know, it should stay, but then I'm gonna release the paper. And hopefully, hopefully, I don't pour this all over my freaking lap. I am not wearing pants right now because I'm actually terrified, but uh, let me go upstairs, get a paper towel, and we're gonna try this trick. Actually, I think I have to, it has to be paper. I just hope this works. I don't want another fail. All right, guys, I'm freaking scared right now, but here we go. Woo! Okay. So, if I flip this over, the paper should stick to the cup. Here we go. It uh, kind of spilled a little bit here. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Here we go. If I keep it completely horizontal, it should be good. 